En anglais, le verbe « faire » est tantôt traduit par le verbe « to do », tantôt par le verbe « to make ». Donc dans cette leçon je vais essayer de vous aider à comprendre la différence entre ces deux verbes ainsi que la manière de les utiliser. A. To do. To do. Et davantage utilisé pour « les travaux ». Une action. Une activité plutôt imprécise les tâches, etc. Examples I do my work with my computer. She does a good job. The boys do their homeworks. I will do my homework when my mom tell me. She has done her grammar exercises. You did your duty. Did she does her homework? My sister did not do anything today. I am doing the housework. Expression avec le verbe to do. To do the housework. To do the housework. Faire le ménage. To do the dishes. To do the dishes. Faire la vaisselle. To do a favor. To do a favor. Faire une faveur. To do one's best. To do one's best. Faire de son mieux. To do the shopping. To do the shopping. Faire les courses. To do business. To do business. Faire des affaires. To do well. To do well. Bien faire. To do one's hair. To do one's hair. Se coiffer. Be. To make. To make est davantage utilisé pour la création de quelque chose, la construction, la réalisation, la production d'une activité de fabrication. Examples I'll make a cake for her birthday. She is making a cake for my birthday. He had made a mistake. I made a house for my dog. My sister makes a present for my birthday. We will make a table for your mother. My wife made a cake for my friend. The clown made everybody laugh. Expression avec le verbe to make. To make a suggestion. To make a suggestion. Faire une suggestion. To make a noise. To make a noise. Faire du bruit. To make an effort. To make an effort. Faire un effort. To make a profit. To make a profit. Faire des bénéfices. To make a mistake. To make a mistake. Faire une erreur. To make an appointment. To make an appointment. Prendre un rendez-vous. To make an agreement. To make an agreement. Conclure un accord. To make a decision. To make a decision. Prendre une décision. To make oneself understood. To make oneself understood. Se faire comprendre. 